Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, thanks for uh, coming back here with me again. A little bit of uh, explanation about this uh, morning's video. I actually had to play the same match twice. I got the same result both times, which is a real rarity. Um, anybody who's ever tried uh, safe scumming knows about that. Um, I played it once and uh, recorded it. Everything looked fine and um, was then playing along a little bit afterwards while I was in the middle of another meeting, as usual. Um, and uh, after doing a whole bunch of uh, scouting things and looking here and there, the game suddenly crashed. Um, and uh, unfortunately, I'd forgotten to save after uh, the initial 1-1 draw. And so I thought, well, that's kind of a shame. I have to go back and play the match again. So I've just played it again. I recorded it again and uh, went back into the game. And so far, it works um, sort of. But uh, we'll see if we can get it to crash again. <laughs> I mean, who knows? Um, anyway, this um, uh, led me to think about a couple of things. Though, and I'm not sure if I'm the only one who's experienced this. And I uh, thought I would just uh, go ahead and ask everybody, have you experienced more crashes in FM23 than in any other um, earlier version? Because I certainly have. I mean, there's some stuff that if you've been watching the channel for a while, you know about, right? You know that uh, uh, during the uh, Yenbian save, for example, um, we got to a certain point where we couldn't advance uh, forward in the middle of a match, and the game would, like, glitch out at the same time in the match every single time. I probably could have tried to holiday through it, but, I mean, where's the fun in that? Um, there's been a couple of other things, too, that have been going on. I don't know how it is if you don't use um, editor data files and if you don't sort of mess around with, like, scenarios and stuff that people have put together. Uh, but I can tell you that um, I have had experiences in this save and in other places where the game has suddenly glitched and crashed for no explainable reason and where I've been able to go back over the same ground I just covered with no problem. So I don't know what's going on. I don't know if there's like a problem inherent in Football Manager itself or what exactly the issue is. I would be very interested in knowing um, what uh, the rest of you are um, experiencing. One of the reasons why I was thinking about this just the other day is uh, because we had a visit on our favorite uh, uh, Football Manager forums over on fmscout.com from Darth Furion, who, um, whose World Super League is um, my personal favorite of the uh, Football Manager add-ons. Hasn't come out for FM23 quite yet. There's been a lot of speculation there as to whether he was actually going to come out with it or not, and uh, finally he posted after being silent for many, many months. And I kind of want to share this with you because it is relevant to the uh, subject at hand, right? And you can see here, by the way, um, if you look uh, over on this side of the screen, um, I'm no longer using Pop! OS. I'm using Endeavor OS now after a big change. And yes, you can take the files, move them from one um, to the next, at least on Linux. It worked a lot better than I thought it would. But here we go. Darth Furion is saying I've been working on this version for much for months. I had many issues like corrupt save games, which forced me to restart from scratch. Right? Look at this. I had many issues both private and with this year's version of the game and editor. Crashes, corrupt save games, and I didn't like the new versions I planned. Made a lot of variations. I only noticed the corrupt save games when I tried to load some saves. The crashes were very random. The game would crash, and I was never able to find the cause, and it cost me one uh, month of progress. So that's basically what's going on. Like, um, we won't get into the um, harassment stuff and all of that, which, uh, yeah, you get a lot of interesting people out there. But that's basically what's going on, right? This is another little piece of anecdotal evidence, and it's kind of hard to say. I'm not sure if, like, I could force the crashes to reoccur or not, you know. But at least for me, it definitely feels like uh, Football Manager 2023 is a lot less stable than um, earlier versions of the game. And that, you know, um, is this feeling that, like, the game's going to, like, completely crash and break down at any possible moment. I thought for a while, oh, this is because I have a whole bunch of, like, extra leagues loaded and stuff like that. But as I've been reading on the forums and especially as i see stuff like this from darth furion i'm starting to think that yeah there might really be something to be said about this right like it may actually be the case that um, there is something that's kind of inherently unstable about the game that has been causing a lot of these issues my hope is that when fm25 comes around and we're looking at the new game engine the new like backbone behind everything that things will end up being a lot more stable and that we'll be able to get some of these crazy and really finicky bugs taken care of um i mean it's one thing to have like a bug that's frustrating where like, you know, you can't figure out why your player's unhappy or whatever and you're like, oh man, this is no fun. That's one thing, right? It's a completely different thing though to like be working hard and to have all sorts of progress made in your save and then all of a sudden have the thing just totally glitch out on you. That's not much fun. That's the sort of thing that we really, really want to avoid happening. Um, I can tell you, having uh, seen this with other games, I'm looking at you, OTP, that sometimes when you get 
a certain distance into a game or into a save, and it's, you start getting save corruption issues and all sorts of other weird problems, you get so exasperated that you're like, I'm just going to forget about it. I don't want to do this anymore, right? Hopefully that's not happening in football manager world, but um, yeah, that that is something that is definitely a possibility. Anyway, there you go. Uh, again, I'd love to know what um, others are experiencing and seeing and um, uh, would uh, very much uh, look forward to uh, seeing uh, your feedback below. I'll talk to you later. Bye.